Hello everyone, this is Shiva with BMWSuperbikes.com and you're looking at a uh, 2D brand MotoGP style LCD dash for BMW K1300S. This video is a brief overview of uh, this pretty, pretty awesome gear. Highly recommend it. Um, if, you can, if you can afford it, by all means, this is a very, very nice addition to the bike. Uh, right now the bike is turned off, it's in neutral and um, um, the ignition is on, however the bike hasn't started yet. N is for neutral, the bike is not in gear, zero is zero miles per hour, um, obviously the bike hasn't moved yet. That's your clock, uh, 7.26 p.m. or until 26 hours. Your total miles, 27.98 miles so far. That's of course you can change the kilometer, it's not a problem. And um, one of the nice things about this dash is that it has actually a, a startup sequence. And what does that mean is that when you uh, turn your ignition on and as you start, on top you get this row of lights. Th that's your startup sequence. As the bike warms up, these lights gradually diminish. And uh, here, this is your tack. When you uh, just start a bike, when it's cold, you will get a suggested rev limit of 4K. Now keep in mind the bike is not going to limit you, you can go above it, but it's telling you that it's suggested for this to be at 4K. Also when you do install the dash, you will get a, a new switch, which is here, called, uh, has a, it's a toggle switch, has a menu and set, and also your info button, which is a, um, for using the computer function, that is still um, workable and I'm going to actually go through that in just a minute. On the um, middle here, this is where the info button can come into play. As you play with info, you just saw ambient temperature, you see uh, average miles per gallon, uh, you see trip one, trip two, you will see RDC which is, again, the bike needs to be running for RDC which is tire pressure uh, to show you will also see your, it actually gives you a fuel gauge and a fuel, low fuel warning plus miles to empty. Also, you will see your ESA function, ESA is electronic suspension adjustment. Right now it's in comfort for a rider. And um, they are, as I said, there are four modes. I'm going to toggle the modes by hitting the set button here. From road it goes to race. Now race things change. Um, you had your gear previously here in road mode, now in race it's up here and your uh, miles per hour is down below because on track uh, speed isn't that important. What's important is your rev. Um, and you have um, information regarding how fast you've, uh, you've lapped and how many laps, uh, how many laps you've done and so forth. Uh, and when you toggle again you get info. Info is fantastic for post race information or post track day information. And then you have setup. Setup you can adjust the background light, adjust your clock, you can adjust how bright these uh, lights should be uh, and various, uh, various other things. You're going to go back to road mode. Now I'm going to start the bike up. Bike starts right up. Um, the warm up RPM is at 1300. Obviously the uh, ABS light is blinking because the bike hasn't moved yet. In about a, a three feet or one meter, the ABS will sink and the lights will go away. If you want to see the uh, ESA, the electronic suspension in, uh, in motion. By the way, I want you to keep, to keep an eye on these lights and keep an eye on the suggested rev limiter. Uh, as the bike warms up, these lights will diminish and the rev will go up gradually. Again, the bike will not stop you. I've already just taken a suggestion that keep the lab rev below this number. We already lost one light and it has gone over 4,000. As it warms up, let me show you the ESA function. Right now it's comfort and a rider. That's a normal and sport. That's your uh, damping setting. Comfort, normal and sport. Then there's a preload setting which you press and hold. And that gives you rider plus luggage. Rider passenger. That's also uh, considered rider, passenger, and luggage, by the way. And again, you are back to rider. I like to keep the back in comfort on city streets because we have bad roads. 
if you look up here, your lights are diminishing and the RPM is now, the suggested RPM or your suggested red line is at about 6K. It will gradually go to full 11,000 RPM. The bike is hovering at around 1,300. And that's really pretty much uh, what I wanted to show you. As the bike is warming up again, the lights will diminish. Very, very cool feature. Highly recommended. Highly recommended. Let me start it so you can just let me light it up. Highly recommended, and um, I hope that you enjoyed this very brief uh, overview of a very hot um, add-on for this bike. This is Shiva with BMWSuperbikes.com. Thank you.